More frequently, we are being asked the question about converting from QuickBooks desktop to online. And it's a question we've actually asked ourselves recently as well for our real estate company. My name is Jerry Frank and I'm CEO of Stratifolio. And today I'm here with Oneida Franco, founder of Franco Blueprint to discuss this very hot topic. Good morning, Oneida. Hi, good morning, Jerry. How are you? Good. Thank you for joining us today to talk about this super hot topic. I'm really excited to get your perspective on the pros and cons of switching to QuickBooks Online. We will right. begin. So what do you see as the biggest advantages in moving your real estate business from QuickBooks Desktop to QuickBooks Online? Well, one of the big, biggest advantages uh, for me is uh, real-time updates. Uh, you can access the data from any any device. You don't have to run back to the office or if you, let's say that you're on the run and you're making an appointment nowadays, you know, you're always moving about. Mm -hmm. um, there's a paradigm shift happening where uh, people are more and more not at the office, but they're meeting and working, you know, outside. So that's uh, one of the biggest advantages. You can just open up your laptop and let's say you're, I don't know, New York or you're traveling to Florida and you have your laptop, you're in a Starbucks, you can open it up and start working. Uh, so that's to me, one of the major biggest, big, uh, biggest advantages. What if you're just starting out in real estate? What would you recommend and why? I think if you're just starting out in real estate or in any industry uh, for that matter, I always recommend that you think big. Think like you're a 500, you know, a Fortune 500 company. Um, why? Because I think it's important to, to, to set a strong foundation from the very beginning. Uh, one of the biggest, um, if you're starting out and let's say perhaps you can't hire a property management, QuickBooks Online has a feature that you can set up recurring transactions for your invoices and you don't have to worry at the first of the month having to email, the, uh, print them out, mail them or kind of save it into PDF and mail. So it saves you that, um, you know, that headache or that time. It, it just makes things more seamless mm -hmm. for you. Great. For us, moving from desktop to online, cost was a consideration for us. As someone who has helped many people now convert from QuickBooks desktop to online, what do you tell them about this, this cost impact? Yeah. I think uh, one of the best things about QuickBooks Online, the way the payment structure is set up, that it's a monthly fee. And if you work with a pro advisor, you are able to get 50% off of the life of service of that monthly fee. Whereas QuickBooks Desktop, you might pay only a one-time fee. And also, depending on the desktop version that you are getting, after that, you have to pay also for updates on a yearly basis. And any add-on also services that you need, you have to add it on. Whereas QuickBooks Online is one monthly fee and everything is included, customer service, uh, your transactions, the connectivity to your banks. Mm -hmm. So it's, it's a very significant uh, cost savings. Yeah, and sometimes I think the, some of the costs are actually hidden. Um, so when you think about backups, which many people who use QuickBooks desktop don't actually back up like they should, but should they be backing up? There's a cost there. And I think there is a cost that's not factored in from an efficiency standpoint. Can you talk about some of the things where uh, the QuickBooks online version is more efficient for the individual using it than if they were using QuickBooks desktop? Sure. Uh, one of the major things is customer support. So QuickBooks Online, it's included in the membership. You can call them at any time. You can call directly your pro advisor, the person that actually helped you set up and do um, the transition from desktop. Whereas QuickBooks Desktop, you actually, they, I believe they give you 30 days free customer support, but after that, <clears throat> you have to pay for it. You have to pay a, a yearly fee. And, and there's also different levels of, of support and membership. So it's like for $89, you will get this. For $300, you will get that. Whereas QuickBooks uh, Online, it doesn't have that. It's just included in the monthly fee. Are there other transactions that are more efficient from the desk, on the online versus the desktop? Uh, yes. Uh, I can think of a few. Uh, connecting your bank accounts and downloading the transactions. Um, 
uh, as I mentioned before, the automatic um, invoice uh, um, recurring transactions. Uh, let's see here. Um, you just have instant uh, file access. Like I said, your um, to to your data and also your accountants. You don't have to like back it up, send them the backup. You know, you don't have to make that drive. They have instant access to to your files as well. Have you ever had a situation where a file has been corrupted or the file has been lost or you've lost data? Yeah, recently we had a client that their files were corrupted and we were doing a conversion of about five to six years. And so it was, it was very stressful for, for us and for the client. Um, luckily, we were able to you know, avert the situation and, and recoup the data. But it, it's something that we, you know, tell our clients, you have to back up, you have to make sure, uh, because it could be six, six years of data, you know, that's being lost. But, um, and, and not only that, not only the time and the stress, but there was additional costs for the client involved as well. Yeah, and there's, there's always the opportunity for a lightning strike or something that could cause you to actually lose all your data. And maybe never recover it. Yeah, power outages here in a big city. I mean, it, it has happened. Right, right. Online does not have that problem. <laughs> no, it does not. What are the major differences between the two systems? Uh, I'm, I'm gonna reiterate again, the major difference is that the platform is online and that you can access all of your information at any point in time. You don't have to, you know, you're traveling, you don't have to call the office or you could just open up your laptop and, and the information is accessible. Um, uh, we, let's see here, it, it, you can integrate it with the 300 plus cloud-based applications. Nice. The integration is much more seamless than if, if you were on desktop. Um, th those are two big major, major differences to me just because QuickBooks Online uh, or QuickBooks or any accounting software to, for that matter always needs complementing softwares and you're always using different um, Excel, whether it's Excel or another platform to really get all the data together that you need and QuickBooks Online helps you with that it integrates with 300 plus applications out there to make you know your your accounting um, systems much more efficient Great. How can people contact you if they are interested in moving their biz, their real estate business from QuickBooks desktop to online? All right, we're uh, on our website, francoblueprint.com. We have Twitter, our handle is Franco uh, Blueprint. Uh, also, we have a Facebook page. You can send us a message on our website. Uh, we have our phone numbers, our emails. You can schedule a free consultation as well. Great, thank you so much, Oneida. We hope this, we really hope this discussion helps others wade through this decision. And by the way, one final plug for Stratifolio. Stratifolio is a cloud-based asset management software solution that provides analytics and insights for people who own, manage, and lease real estate. Our product does connect directly with Quick QuickBooks, both online and desktop, to help provide you with insights and manage your assets efficiently and effectively. You can quickly get your major metrics from all your different legal entities consolidated into a single interactive dashboard, like cash flow, debt coverage ratio, loan to value, among many others. And you can keep your documents in one place and manage your investors. If you found this video of value, please share it or give us a like on Facebook, Twitter, Google Plus, and LinkedIn. And we appreciate the likes and comments. Please keep them coming. Thank you.